Bursary scheme offered to virg uh, virgin maidens in KwaZulu-Natal. The Democratic Alliance has lodged a complaint with the Human Rights Commission, but the mayor of uh, Utukela District Municipality, Dudu Mazibuko, remains undeterred. The bursary is offered to girls who are virgins. It will see them through tertiary level for as long as they remain virgins. But it's been met with a lot of opposition. This young rape survivor says the scheme is discriminatory. I don't think it's a good idea because I lost my virginity when I was four. I was raped by my grandfather, so I don't think it's a good idea because I also need an education. The DA has taken the matter to the Human Rights Commission. The party says it will continue fighting against the decision. We will definitely uh, look at other avenues, but obviously we have to wait. We'll give it a chance to Human Rights Commission. Uh, let's see what investigation uh, they will be doing. The Commission for Gender Equality says it's opposed to the municipality's stance. It discrim discriminates against young girls on the basis of their sexuality, of their, the, the status of their virginity. It violates their rights to privacy, to dignity. It discriminates against young girls who are not virgins. But the fund of the scheme says there are good intentions behind its establishment. The opposition will always criticise, but we think this is a noble idea that is going to help uh, to reduce in this district the teenage, uh, teenage pregnancy and also the infections of HIV and AIDS. The ANC in KwaZulu Natal says it backs the maiden's bursary. It says the scheme encourages young women to preserve themselves. Mlungi Sikumalo, SAPC News, Lady Smith. The Mangaung Metro.